I grew up in a pretty straightforward family. I was a kid that was always on the go, full of energy. I loved reading, I had friends. But I remember kind of feeling kind of flat. It seems like so oversimplified to say that you were just experiencing such a pervasive sadness, but that is what it felt like for me. When I was 13, I remember sitting in home ec class. I can't remember what I was doing, but that's when the thoughts of wanting to, you know, not be here anymore came about. When you're constantly living in your own head, when you're on pain, and when you feel you can't open up to someone, then those thoughts become your reality. I was just kind of floating along, not functioning very well, not sleeping. You know, even like thinking of going for a shower would be like climbing Mount Everest. I later went to a psychotherapist and that was really helpful. It helped me get into meditation and mindfulness. By living in the moment, it makes things a lot easier because you don't have to worry about the past or the future. You only have to worry about this moment now, you know. Of course I have rows with people, of course I get sad news, you know, of course things veer off in the maddest way and, and I can't control them. My mental health journey was my journey and I wouldn't take it back for anything because it's made me who I am now. I love life and I enjoy life and I savour every bit of it.